rest of my life if I were the DJ. But when your legs don't work like they used to before. Hey, are you registered to vote? There's a primary on August 23rd and the general election on November 8th. Wait, come back, wait. So apparently this filter will like show your favorite photo in your camera roll. So um let's just check and see if it's true. Oh no, 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 nothing to see here. Nothing. Um, yeah, so I was going to um, wait to reply because I'm actually out to lunch right now, but I just want to let this person know who commented this. I can run quite a bit and I can go upstairs without getting out of breath. Just because I'm fat does not mean I am. <laughs> this is so hard. <sighs> What would you do if you saw me at the red light and I honked my horn at you and we made eye contact and I said to you, What's up, baby girl? What would you say? What would you do if. Call the police for me! What's going on? He ran me over, I jumped on the hood, 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 the
quoi ça? Oups, il y a un loup! Il y a un loup dans la bergerie! <rire> Three more phrases I literally can't stop saying. No cap. Oh, I guess that's a bonus one. <laughs> Number one. What the dog doing? <laughs> Number two. Sheesh. <laughs> Sheesh. <laughs> Number three. My anaconda don't. My anaconda. <laughs> Hey man, you haven't been answering any of my calls. What's going on? What's what's up? Hey, uh, yeah, you know, I'm I'm just I'm just busy. You know, like life life sometimes can get the best of us. <laughs> Don't call me. Don't come by my house. I'm done. Yeah. Hey yo, you forgot my shape. Shake that dick, sweetie. Hi, my shoe has a tear. Can I get a new pair? Yeah, sure. As long as it's been under 30 days. I'm not talking about your 30-day exchange policy. I've actually read your turn. Yeah, I don't care, lady, but let me call my manager. Yo, Bobby. Yeah, this lady wants sneakers for free. No, dude, she's talking about terms, policies. I have no idea what's going on. All right, I'll tell her. Yo, we still seeing minions after work? Nice. It's as I feared. Bobby doesn't care either. But here, you can take my sneakers. They're Nikes. I don't know if you care. I'm sure you do. I actually read your terms, and I know that as long as it's been less than six months ah, since I purchased, it. I it's covered I quit. under warranty. Hey. And I need quit. Someone tell Bobby. Bobby. Is there a problem? Oh, that was me and my family. We were camping last night. Yeah, we were in the woods, yeah. Yeah, we were up pretty late. We were having a blast. I'll tell him to keep it down. Thank you. What did I tell you? I should have figured out bite their neck, keep them quiet. I don't care what you have to use, keep them quiet. You're right, it won't happen again because if it does, you're dead. Last chance. I've heard a lot of men talk about how they're stronger than women, how they're fitter than women, but to counter. Scientists have been able to fertilize eggs without sperm, which means eventually women will not need men to reproduce. And on top of that, their offspring will not have the Y chromosome, which means they will not be able to reproduce men. On top of that, there's also the theory that the Y chromosome is naturally going to go extinct over the next few thousand years, which means men will cease to exist anyway. So you want to talk about Darwinism, you want to talk about survival of the fittest, guess what babe, you do not survive, you are not the fittest. Right, Speaking bro, in a baby do. voice to my friends and seeing if they do it back. Hi, Hi Johnny. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Johnny. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? What are you doing right now? I'm just, uh, I'm just at the gym right now. I miss you. I miss you too, Alex. Did you have a good workout? Shell Global. I understand you're looking for a TikTok expert to catapult Shell to be one of the best content creators on TikTok. Well, I'm your man. It's so great you're doing this. Let me catapult you, Shell. Here are some content ideas for your gas company that children will love. A viral dance called the Carbon Offset. Wow. A hype house in my local gas station. Fire. A company mascot of a decomposed plankton at the bottom of the ocean. Gas. Or fun duets with our fans. Could Shell go green by 2050? Well, not without your help, so show us what you mean. What is this? What makes me qualified? Well, with over 80,000 followers, I have the most followers on TikTok. And similar to you, I have a hard time taking responsibility for my actions. We're perfect together. You don't want these viral ideas to go to waste. Or even worse, to Saudi Aramco. Thanks, 
understand. Hi, sorry. Hi. I'm Michael. I'm the manager. Nice to meet you. Um, you're, sorry, first. What's your name? Inez. Karen. Nope, not even and close. Your <laughs> uh, miss. Miss. Hello, yeah. Karen. Uh, um, Inez, but miss, whatever. <laughs> no sorry. worries. How may I help you today? My dog's been missing for a month, and I was hoping you could put the okay. flyer up in your shop right, can somewhere. I see it, please? Yeah, go for it. Thank you. No worries. Where's the, oh, yeah, that's the there. dog. <laughs> so I can see the name's problem. Fluffy. Obviously, your voucher's mm-hmm. out of date. It's, sorry, voucher. It's, it's it's nothing to do with us. Uh, you'd have to just head okay, off I know it's nothing to do with you. I was just hoping you'd put it up in your shop somewhere. Why do you keep putting a voucher? Month. Yeah, my dog's been missing for a month. It's quite sad. Oh, sorry, actually. I am the manager of the store. Oh, thank you. Yes. Good for you. The store manager's not here. Uh, I'm managing the store right now. I just want to know if you're going to put the flyer up. To be honest. Okay. No? Well, you have a lovely day. Okay. Bye. You knew I should have gone to Tesco's. I told you. Hey, colonizer. What's not okay is to project your anger onto people who want to be allies. Then don't be an ally. Girl, your attitude is the definition of a white savior complex. If your allyship is so dependent on the fact that he and his people do not hurt your feelings, your commitment to his movement is not that strong to begin with. Listen, here's the thing about being an ally. The number one job you have as one is to defer to people with marginalized identities that you want to be an ally to. How his movement makes you feel does not matter. He doesn't have space for that. He doesn't have to make space for that. His page is not a negotiation table where you can come in and demand what's gonna work for you. Expecting that he's gonna engage in some sort of conversation about how you two can meet in the middle. No, the only term of negotiation that is acceptable in his own movement is that you meet him and his people where they are. They provide a direction, and if that makes you feel uncomfortable, that discomfort is yours and yours only to deal with. That's a radical concept of decentering yourself. He does not need your help that you will generously provide if he caters to you. Thank you, the body. Oh. <sighs> <laughs> you halfway got it. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> you even find that thing because it's like 30 yards over there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you real Jim? Wait till it gets to the top of the water and decides it don't want to be there anymore. Yeah. <clears throat> That's going to be fun. Watch, he's gonna break the line. I don't think we broke it yet. I saw a bubble. Yeah, the fish are running for their lives. Oh. What the fuck oh. is that? Oh, uh, is that orange? Yeah, dude. It is orange. Careful, careful, careful. Bring him up slow. Is he over there? Yeah, Charlie's back out of the way. Is that an orange turtle? That's the anchor. That's the anchor. I swear to God. 